What's going on, Warriors? Man. This is crazy, man. I can't even believe this is happening. Um, so Chadwick Boseman is dead. I don't understand it. First Kobe Bryant. Beautiful, inspirational man. Talented. Is dead. And now... Chadwick Boseman? Such a wonderful human being. An inspirational man. And whose presence in the world only made the world a better place. And the reason I say that it's true is because he's an inspiration. You understand when you have somebody who is successful, that has achieved, that is awesome, sends out a positive message, it inspires other people to be like him. A good person pays off, a hard working person pays off, dedicated to purpose pays off helping people and being good to people is important and that's what i saw in chadwick boseman someone who used his platform to empower people to empower those and lift those up around him and even those he didn't know but he knew that he could reach with his words and his work. He just wanted to pick everybody up. I can't believe it. He was suffering from cancer for four years. In pain. Yet he still persevered. And now you look at his films like 42. Black Panther. Marshall. All his movies... He was put. He was trying to put out a incredible, inspirational, meaningful body of work to inspire people, to inspire generations. He's such a good person, a beautiful man. And um, to be honest with you, I didn't even really want to do this video. You know, I don't I didn't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. You know, yesterday, I literally spent most of the day in my duvet. My head in my pillow. In my duvet. Just trying to block out everything and block out the world. Because I didn't want to deal with it. The world lost such a wonderful, beautiful human being that could only inspire generations. Kids looked up to him. Kids wanted to be him. Everybody was like, the king, my king. When you have somebody that kids look up to, it's a powerful thing. Because he's inspiring generations. These kids are going to be adults one day. That could potentially change the world. And then they're getting their inspiration to be good. From someone like Chadwick Boseman. Because he's always putting out a good message. Visiting kids in hospitals. Kids that were suffering. That had terminal cancer. He was buying them gifts. Being there for them. Doing his best for them. Yet he was suffering with cancer himself. Man. It's just shocking to me. It's just shocking to me. I don't want to accept it. I still can't accept it as real. But it is. You know, yesterday... I was watching Infinity War. Well, I watched Civil War. 
uh, Captain America, Civil War. I watched Black Panther. Yeah. And it just... I was just surprised, man. Just overwhelmed that he's dead. And he was at the beginning. He was literally at the height of his achievements. And he was only 42, 43. And, he, and the thing is, yeah, what always just, it hurts, man. He's a good person. He was using his platform to inspire people. And a movie, when you look at something like uh, movies like Black Panther. And that movie changed the movie industry. That movie showed that the world, people want to see films with black people in it. They want to see a film with different cultures. And it opened the door for other cultures. Like Asian characters. Asian stories. Like look at like, Kamala Khan. In the Avengers um, video game. You know it opens the, um, the world. It shows that the world wants to see different cultures. Different ethnicity, ethnicities. People want to see it all. But the movie wasn't just for black people. The movie was for everybody. It was for Asian people. It was for white people. It was for European people. The movie was for everybody. The movie Black Panther brought everybody together to celebrate a culture. And just love yourself. Love who you are. What you are and where you're from. You know, even you had... Like in Black Panther. the When Chadwick Boseman was doing a tour of the Black Panther, yeah? They were in Korea. And what it was, was a lot of people, yeah? People that were doing interviews uh, with the Black Panther. They were... A lot of people... And this was all over the world, but a lot of places, yeah, they were actually coming to Black Panther wearing their own traditional cultural garments. And they did the Wakanda forever, but in their country's um, greeting. Wakanda forever. How incredible is that? It made people proud and to express them their culture that they will come to black panther in their own cultural country's garments and do um and greet um chadwick boseman and the black panther cast in their own culture greeting wakanda forever do you understand how beautiful that is chadwick boseman's character his portrayal his acting his grace is what inspired that and he was a beautiful good man that made people feel happy and comfortable to express that too thus for changing the landscape it's heartbreaking man it's heartbreaking that such a beautiful man is dead i can't believe it Beginning of last week, as far as everybody knew, Chadwick Boseman is fine, healthy, happy. A week later, we're talking about him being dead. Rest in peace. Rest in power, Chadwick Boseman. You're absolute beautiful legend whose work inspire billions and will change the lives of generations and futures to come your incredible body of work it has meaning
Wakanda forever.